Hi, I'm going to show you how to install the first flash elevator into your rainwater harvesting system and how it works. First is to seal one side of the pipe with the elevator chamber drain. The other side stays open, that's where the transition fitting goes and the water valve. It will be connected with the downpipe from the gutter and the pipe to the tank. This is the new transition fitting we have and this is the water valve that does all the magic. I'll show you how. When the water chamber is empty, the first flash of contaminated water is diverted into the chamber. Once the chamber is full, the valve closes itself and allow fresh and clean water flows into the tank. The other designs come with a floating bowl, but it all works the same way. Once the water chamber is full, a floating bowl closes the way and allow fresh and clean water to flow into the tank. I was not able to save the old transaction fitting, so we had to buy a new one and it's a little bit different. The previous one, it needed PVC glue to join all the parts together, but this one has rubbers. So as you can see, I'm patiently fitting each part one by one, the rubber and the cap, everything, the pipe, to make sure it's all connected. So far, the water valve looks it's fit perfect. Now let's see if it's going to join where I want it to join. Yes, but I need a little short pipe to join to the down pipe from the gutter. There it is. Now I just have to do my measurement from the transition to the tank. It's ruined focus. That is perfect because you're going to see how it flushes. So here we go. It's all fitted. And now let's go and see if it's going to flush after the rain. Guys, what do you think about this? Drop a comment, subscribe to the YouTube channel. Thank you for watching.